Hello everyone, I just wanted to show something off. So, like any good hacker, uh, every so often I feel a desire to make stuff. Recently, what I've been on uh, doing is two things. Uh, the first one is chainmail, uh, namely a little bit of jewelry. So, my first two pieces were um, a couple aluminum uh, bracelets. I made uh, one in a half version for one, one in full Persian, and I made one in uh, aluminum and um, nickel silver for Alex, which is something that he wears. But the reason that I did this is because I wanted to make a necklace for a pendant that a friend had given me. So what that means is you get something like this. So this is just a whole bunch of five and five thirty-second inch inner diameter rings, twenty gauge. The, these are actually sterling silver. It's about one ounce right there. Um, and turn it into this. So, da da da. Doesn't show up very well on the camera, but that's the pendant. It's a moonstone. It was given to me by a friend. And that's the necklace. You can see it has a sort of rectangular uh, cross section. It feels very nice. Um, very smooth when I don't drop it. Um, and that's about where it sits on me. I just don't want to bother with the clasp right now. Incidentally, one word on clasps. I did try these little magnetic clasps that I got online. Looks like that. There's lots of forms that they come in, but basically if you slide them apart, it's just magnets. So inside there is those little magnets and you bring them together and they just snap together. Um, I thought this was cool and convenient and they look decent. However, uh, I cannot recommend them strongly because I lost the bracelet because of them. The f unfortunate fact is that these magnets are simply way too weak and as a result the bracelets come off very easily even in just everyday stuff we're not talking like heavy-duty work this is just you brush your hands up you brush yourself against a table anything like that and occasionally it'll fall off um, and as a result I lost one of my bracelets fortunately it wasn't a very uh, expensive bracelet it was one of my first test ones it was just aluminum but nevertheless I don't like losing stuff um, anyway that's one thing I wanted to show the other thing is a work in progress if you look behind me see that that's a sewing machine on the table uh, what I'm making is a doublet so this is the fabric green velvet. Uh, so far I've gotten through making the lining which is this simple cotton and this which is actually uh, cotton velveteen. Sorry it's not velvet uh, because I prefer natural fibers and also it looks really nice. Um, so so far this is just the shells. I haven't yet added the um, buttons to the front, the button loops, and I haven't gone through all the other stuff about trimming and embroidery and wrapping it all together, etc. Um, this is just the start of the project, but it should be fun. And just for what it's worth, I don't do this for any special occasion. Uh, I just like to wear stuff um, that's fun in general everyday situations. So that that's something that I would be wearing just as often as I would wear this shirt, for example. It's no different to me except it makes me grin. So I think that doing stuff that makes you grin on a daily basis is a very good thing. Anyway, those are two projects of mine. I just wanted to show them off. Bye.